watch where you're going. You're gonna get hit. <sighs> oh, I'm fine, young man. I just wasn't watching where I was going. Well, you should. You saved my life, thank God. Que Dios te bendiga. Nada que ver. Just passing by. Anything wrong, sir? You seem to have a lot on your mind. No, no es nada. Please, sir, you seem to be in need of counsel. Counsel? How would you feel if you did something horrible, almost unforgivable? Well, I would say that I would feel horrible and saddened. But if you really feel bad, the Lord will forgive you. But, but what if it's something that's very heavy in your heart? The Lord is a very forgiving person. He's always watching over you. Then, come with me. You see this? This is a symbol of hope. It's what people look for. Es la veladora de la Virgen de Guadalupe. La Virgen de Guadalupe? What's so special about her? She doesn't seem that important. Lady Guadalupe? La Virgen de Guadalupe? She's the mother of our Savior Jesus Christ. This symbol is hope for our neighborhood. At night, it is a light showing that the lady is watching over all for protection. The light is also a beacon of hope, for as long as the light is burning, we know that the lady is protecting us. Ben, come with me. In this mural, that is Juan Diego. He was a ranch hand. When the lady appeared to him, asking him to build a church in her name. People didn't believe him. Even the church did not believe him, but his faith did not leave him. And through a miracle, they built the church. So this uh, Juan Diego dude, was he just an average Joe hearing voices? No, he was an Indian ranch hand who heard the mother of Jesus. It goes to show that God watches over all and even the most average person may be working with God. God is always watching, and so is the Lady of Guadalupe. They watch over these lands with kindness and forgiveness. But miss, what if the sin is too great for one to bear? Mijo, no sin is too great. There once lived a man in Jerusalem who was the son of a carpenter. He was born with a purpose in life. When he became an adult, he was destined to inspire hope into the hearts and minds of people. He had followers who would go around teaching people the way to good living. He was betrayed though, and was sentenced to death. But he knew since early in life, this day would come that he would face his destiny to all mankind by sacrificing himself. It was through this he inspired hope in people hope that would atone for what we have done so that all sins may be forgiven. Wow, that seems like a tall order. I think I like this man, this person, this supreme being. It makes me feel, it makes me feel hopeful. There's always someone watching you, Lorenzo. All your life and you never knew it was there guiding you when you needed guidance, and helping you when you sought help. I know what I need to do now. Thank you. You've saved my soul as I have saved yours, maybe even a lot more. There's someone always watching you. You may not see it, but you can feel it's always there.